Hello everyone, this is Just a Dad. Today I'm gonna do a comparison between these two Shark Wanvacs. On the left, I got the model number WV201, and on the right, I got the model number WV410BL. This has more of a blue color to it. Now this one does have a boost mode, so you're simply gonna turn it on. It's got good suction. You're gonna hit the boost mode with even more suction. Turn it off, take it to your trash can. To open this up, you're gonna move that back. Everything comes out. We've got a filter in here. Once in a while, we do have to clean this filter. That is washable, but make sure and let it dry overnight. Both of these, whenever you dock them, that's gonna make it charge. Over here, simple to operate. Press the button, good suction, turn it off. When you're done, move this lever forward and then everything's gonna empty out. We also have a filter here. Sometimes you are gonna have to clean out these filters. That's what it looks like, very, very easy to work on. And I can even remove this and take this to the sink, get this all nice and clean, make sure it dries, and put it back on and put it there. It's gonna charge right here on the dock. This one charges down here. There's a connection right here, and that's how it charges that wand back. Both of them have a cord that you are gonna to have to plug in, and the, the wires are attached to the bases permanently. Here's what the bottom of the bases looks like. The wire comes in. Both of these come with a crevice tool. So you're gonna sit there, you can put the crevice tool in. A little bit different crevice tool, but you know, at the end they look the same. You got the little brush that comes forward. Got the little brush that comes forward. So with the crevice tool installed, you know, the one on the left is a little bit longer. But they both have the same feel and grip to them and they're very easy to operate. And they both have this other attachment. These attachments are a little bit different. But I like that the attachments store in the base so that you always know where they're at. Let's go clean some things with it and see how well they clean. Okay, I got a really big mess here. We're gonna compare, see how each one of these does. On this one, I do have the boost mode and then I'm gonna try the crevice tool. So let's turn them on. Yeah, I feel like they both got really good suction. Let's try the crevice tool. Okay, I got the crevice tool on. I feel like I can get way down in there, get those all nice and clean. I got the brush on. Let's take the brush off. All right. Yeah, I'm getting this chair all nice and clean. Okay, so let's empty this one out, the blue one here first. It's got chambers all nice and full. You're gonna take it over there, move that lever, be sure you're ready and clean it out. Sometimes you do have to kind of help stuff. It does get kind of caught in around here, but this is what it does. And then sometimes you got to take the filter out and clean it. Okay, so this is the model number WV201. I really like it. Take it over to the trash can. You're simply going to press this. There's like a spring action. It, I like that it gets everything out nice and clean, even though that had a bunch of stuff in it. Close it and you're ready to go. Okay, so I've been wanting to do this comparison for some time because I these look the same on the line, you know, but there is quite a bit of difference. This one, the WV201, it's retailing for about $100 right now. This one, the 410BL, $170. I did buy both of these off, off of Amazon under the used. Over on the right-hand side, you click the little thing where you can buy them used. They're in great shape. I paid about $100 for both of them. Now, I did think this one shined. The wv 201s maybe this is a newer one, but I felt like when you open it, it gets rid of everything a lot better. You know, this one, and it's bigger as far as the comparison, as far as the bin. This one, I did have to kind of go in there and get some of that stuff, the hair out. That might be a little older design. This one's definitely heavier, but they dock differently and they charge differently. That's, you know, I was very intrigued by these vacuum cleaners. So I thought, well, how could these be so different? But they are extremely different. And really, nothing is interchangeable. The tools aren't interchangeable. The bases aren't interchangeable. I would definitely recommend this one. It's lightweight. I felt like they both had this exact same suction. I will put links to these in the show description underneath the video. If you click on the see more, you'll see links to these where you can purchase these. I am a ninja or an Am a shark affiliate and an Amazon affiliate. If you click on the links, the product won't cost you anymore. Also, if you could hit the thumbs up the button, that really does help out my YouTube channel. Hit the subscribe button if you want to see more videos like this. If you'd like to see this compared to some other vacuum cleaner, let me know in the comments. Really appreciate everybody's support. If you could, please like and subscribe and thanks for watching.